Today I'll be showing you guys an ATM robbery script. This script has some customizable options. It gives players another criminal activity to do. I'll leave links in the description to the resource and the dependencies. I hope you enjoy the video. Alright, so first click the first link in the description that takes you to the resource. And once you're here, we're going to hit code, download zip. Once it's done, we're going to open it up and we're also going to open our server resources. We're then going to drag what we just downloaded into our server resources. And once it's in here, we're going to rename it and remove the main from the end. Then from here, we're going to go to our server CFG and ensure the resource. And we're going to hit file and save. After you save that, we're going to go to the resource to see what's available and if we need to change anything before we test it out. We're going to go ahead and open the config file. So choose whichever framework you're using. I'll be staying with Cubicore. Below that, choose whichever dispatch you're using. The only available options are PS Dispatch or CE Dispatch. If you don't have either of these, we'll still want to use the resource. I'll leave a link in the description to PS Dispatch. It is free and works very well. The hack item is the item players need to have in their inventory to be able to rob the ATM. In this resource, there aren't any explosions or anything blowing up, so I'm going to change it from Thermite to Electronic Kit. Hack type is for the minigame patterns. You have to find a code in one of the forms listed. I'll show an example of the Greek form and the numeric form. I'll leave it at Greek. The hack time is how long you have to do the minigame. And the hacking time, the second option, is how long the progress bar is before the hack interface is triggered. Now, in this resource, you can have players receive regular cash by setting this to true or had them receive black money by keeping it at false. I'm going to change it to true. Um, after that, you have the minimum and maximum payments. I'm going to make this 5,000 and 10,000. The next part is how many cops you want to have on duty for the robbery to be able to be accessed. And after that is a cooldown in minutes before the robbery can be done again. Since I am testing this, I'll just keep them both at zero. You can do what you wish. After you've set everything up how you want it, we're going to hit file and save. Then you can start your server and test it out. Alright, so as you can see, we're in the server and we have an electronic kit. So we're going to go ahead and rob the ATM. All right. All right, so we got the cash and everything's working fine. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and a sub. If you need help, feel free to comment down below.